Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel if you're returning. Welcome if you're new. My name is Rachel and I am a full-time mama and a reseller on sites like eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. And today we have an unboxing video from Helpsy Source. This is the Men's Everlane Denim New with Tag, New Without Tag box. So if you want to see what they sent me this time, definitely stick around. So I love sourcing online, especially now that I have a little baby and um, I get the inventory shipped right to me. I am a thrifter too. Hopefully eventually I can get back into thrifting, but for now I am love getting this stuff shipped to me. And I love coming onto my channel and showing you what's in the box so that if you're a reseller, you can make you know decisions about sourcing your, for your own reseller business. Um, so today's box is from Helpsy Source and ordinarily I do um, like to unbox everything, like open the box on camera. This one's already open as you can see. Um, and that is because, um, number one, I half of it was in my last box, which was the Everlane Intimates box. I'll link that video down below if you want to watch it. It was my very last video. Um, so some of that was some of it was in another box, and also I ordered a bunch of stuff from Helpsy, so I had to like make sure I knew what was in each box. But I haven't looked at any of this yet, even though the box is open. I swear you're seeing it for the first time. Uh, with me. So if you like reseller content, make sure you subscribe. Like I said, I do a lot of unboxing videos and I always come back 90 days later and let you know whether or not I made a profit. With new with tag stuff, online liquidation, I do like to double my money in 90 days. Uh, so I'll come back in 90 days and tell you if I think it was a good box based on what actually sold. Um, drop me a like if you find this helpful and I'm going to get right into it. So this is the Men's Everlane Denim. The box on the site was $480. I uh, do have a 10% off code, which is great. They let me use it myself too. So if you want to shop Helpsy, use code oh yeah when you check out. You'll get 10% off your entire order. It works every time you shop. It works on sale items. If you're going to shop there, you might as well take the 10% off, right? So anyway, this box was $480 on the site. With 10% off, it was $432 making this uh, $10.80 per piece or per pair of jeans, uh, if there are indeed 40 here. They've been really good about being right on the money with the with the counts, so I will count at the end. But anyway, um, I'm gonna go ahead and get into it. Um, I see a lot of black denim. I'm assuming there's gonna be some duplicates, but I'll show you everything anyway. Um, these are relaxed straight jeans, size 32, and they're the Everlane Uniform. I don't see a price on these, but Everlane jeans, I mean, they sell for, they sell for pretty high and, and they, they do hold their retail value. They, they hold their value pretty well. These are the way high jean size 33 long. I thought the way high jean were women's. I could be wrong. Not that I'm mad about it. I think Everlane women's really kind of does sell just as well if not better I'll have to look these might be women's or they might not they might be men's I won't complain the uniform ones I know are men's these are the uniform slim fit performance jean oh size 32 by 30 um let's see these are skinny fit black 36 by 32 I'll tell you what I do like about men that shop on Poshmark, or at least in my experience, I'm sure some women are like this too. They don't really haggle a lot. They don't send a bunch of offers. They don't go back and forth with you. They search, they find something, they buy it. And I will say with a lot of men's clothes, that's where I get the most of my full price sales. Let me know in the comments if you agree or disagree with me on that. Most of my full price sales, not, not everything that's men's sells for full price, but most of the time, if somebody buys something outright, it's a it's a men's item. I don't know why. Um, these are the performance jean, the skinny jean, size 40 by 30. These are the athletic jean, size 28 by 28. That's a smaller size. So they're not all the same style. I really thought they were all black, so they were all gonna be all the same, but I guess not. 
the slim jean 31 by 32. I'll have to go through and figure out what's what here. There are some blue in here. Uh, I just haven't gotten to them yet. The black ones all happen to be on top, it looks like. These are the slim jean again, 34 by 30. Okay, so these are same jeans, different size. Um, and I say this in a lot of my videos, and I'll say it here too. I don't mind getting the same items, you know, even if it's different sizes, but finding the descriptions and the, you know, the taking the photos is all easier if they're like the same item. So I'm not mad about it. Um, these are the original cheeky jean, size 34, crop. I bet these are women's too. Just by the name of the jean and the, um, the fact that they're cropped, um, and I probably because they're a larger size, the size 34, which is a women's like 18, it's probably why that would have made it into a men's box. Again, I am not complaining, um, but I might be wrong. Like, I guess I'll have to let you guys know. These are 33 long, the way hygiene again. Yeah, I'll let you know if, uh, if I'm wrong and these really are men's jeans. They might be. A few more pair hiding out in the back there. These might all be kind of the same. Uh, the skinny jean, 28 by 30. The slim jean, 32 by 30. These don't have a pocket description. These, these are the slim jean 32 by 28. I don't think I've ever seen a 32 by 28. Or a 28 inseam in general. Is that common? Have you seen, let me know down below if you've seen that before. 32 by 28. I mean, I guess for a, a shorter guy, you would need a 28. Yeah, these are a 32 by 28 too, athletic. So it's kind of an odd size, but I guess kind of good because, you know, if you're short, then you would have to get your pants altered, which I'm sure people do. I know I know they do. I see altered pants at the thrift store all the time and you get them home and you're like, oh, I found these great jeans. And then you measure them and you're like, these are like a 27 inch inseam. So, I mean, there are people out there that need it. Um, I just have never seen a company make a size 28 inseam or sell it a 28 inseam. You have to normally get them altered, but I could be wrong. Um, these are the athletic fit 30 by 34. The slim fit 30 by 32. I think Everlane makes all their jeans with organic cotton or some of them say organic cotton. I bet you they all do. The slim fit jean again. 30 by 32 and everything looks good so far everything has tags which is as described so that's good the performance gene 30 by 30 all right there are some blue ones in here too the slim fit gene 32 by 30 Okay, so probably the same as the black ones, just blue, which is okay. Wish I could make this a little more interesting for you. The Slim Fit 36 by 30. Hang in there with me. We're about halfway done. These are 33 by 34. These are new without tag. Okay, new without tag, 33 by 34. Oh, you want to know what they are, don't you? Uh, these are the skinny jean. I don't know. Are men's skinny jeans still in style? I feel like women's skinny jeans went out of style, but men's maybe are not out of style yet. I don't know. These are the slim fit jean 30 by 32. Uh... 
No tags on these. The Athletic Jean 32 by 32. What exactly makes a pair of jeans athletic? Is that when you have like a tight butt and really big like calves or quads, but you want your jeans to fit skinny, but they gotta be a little bigger because you have muscles? That's my guess. Uh, these are the Athletic Jeans 34 by 32. They stretch a little, so maybe that has something to do with it. The relaxed straight jean. Okay, so these are a different, a different style. Relaxed straight. I really feel like I'm digging into a black hole, like all this black denim. Uh, the slim jean, 32 by 34. Yeah, there's. I, I've lost track at this point, but there's definitely some duplicate styles and sizes. Uh, athletic jeans, 33 by 28. There's that 28 inseam again. Okay. The way high jean again, size 30. I know by the time you guys see this, I will have figured out and will have posted for you whether or not the way hygiene is women's or men's, but for now it's really bugging me because gosh, I really think those are women's. Okay, 28 by 30 athletic jeans. There's still more black denim in there, y'all. Here's some blue ones. Ooh, what are these? The way high jeans. Oh, these are way high jeans again. Size 34. Athletic fit. 31 by 34. Yeah, if you know anyone that needs some Everlane men's jeans, please send them my way. So many jeans. I guess you don't realize how many jeans is 40 pair of jeans. Like, this is a lot of jeans. These are the slim jeans, size 30 by 30, black. That's what makes this unboxings hard. It's like, I keep, there's, they're not that exciting and there's 40 of them uh, to show you, all 40. But when I do the, um, the 90 day update, this will probably be more exciting. Um, these are the slim jeans, size 34 by 32. Way high jeans again. Yep, the way high jean, size 34. got this huge pile like right here it might fall over okay here's some different jeans the 90s cheeky straight jeans there's no way that a pair of jeans called the 90s cheeky straight are men's there's no way um these are a size 33 but you know what if they want to send me all the bigger size women's jeans by accident okay I bet you those are going to sell better than the men's jeans anyway. So I'm not mad. Um, these are slim jeans, 32 by 32. These are 90s cheeky jeans, 28 ankle. Okay, for sure. I've never seen a men's jeans have a size called ankle. These do not have tags though. Smaller size. That's okay. A 28 is like a size six. Okay, I think there's three more, three more pair of jeans. These are men's, 29 by 28 athletic jeans. And what is this? These are like faded black. What are they? The slim jean, 35 by 30. 35, that's an interesting size too. Yeah, these are washed black as opposed to just black. Okay, last pair. Sorry, they're not super exciting. 
These are the Slim Jean 31 by 30. At least they're blue. Okay, let me count and see how many pair of jeans I have here. All right, so right on the money, there are indeed 40 pair of jeans here. So um, my first impression, I mean, I think, okay, for $10.40 per piece, you know, that's a decent um, cost per item for New With Tag Everlane Denim. Um, good variety of sizes and styles. Of course, there are some duplicates. Um, I, I will say I, I do think some of these are women's, which I really don't mind. In fact, I, I feel like I'm a little bit lucky to have received a few pair of women's jeans. However, if, you know, I guess my one criticism would be if you really were looking for um, truly men's jeans and men's jeans only, there are some women's jeans mixed in here. I'm not going to complain, like you said, but, uh, you know, just if I'm being fully transparent here, um, I am interested to see, you know, how saturated the, the market is with these styles, um, being that, you know, there are only a couple of different um, styles here, and I guess it will depend on what the demand is for those styles. So that's why I do the 90-day updates. It's one thing for me to say, like, yeah, this was a great box, but it's another for it to actually be a great box in, in sales. So my goal is to double my money, uh, meaning if I spent $432 on this box, I want to make that $432 back plus another $432 at least in 90 days. Um, this stuff should be very easy to list. To, I like photographing jeans, I like doing flat lace, so that's no big deal. It should be very easy to find maybe stock photos or descriptions and things like that. They're super easy to measure. In fact, a lot of times men's jeans I don't even measure because I mean the size is the measurement. So these should only take me maybe a day or two to list depending on cooperation from my baby. <laughs> um, I at the time of this filming my video this video my baby is uh, six weeks old so she sleeps a lot still but when she doesn't want to sleep there is no getting anything done so um hopefully this won't take too long to get listed but if you are interested in anything like i said check out my stores my goal is to have it all listed by the time this video goes live make sure you're subscribed if you want to see the 90 day update drop me a like on the way out that really does help out my channel a lot and that is all for today. Thank you so much for watching. I will catch you in the next one.